Namaste. Namaste and welcome to Mindfulness Moment. Our journey together continues and it is right here and right now. This is the mindfulness practice. And what I adore about it uh, is that it can be practiced at any time and anywhere. I am glad to be home safe here in the United States and it is just such a privilege and such an honor to practice with you this day. So go ahead and sit well, and you can sit down on the ground if that's a comfortable seat for you. You can sit in a chair. Um, you can choose to stand if that is a place of comfort, of steadiness. We're gonna be doing a lot of grounding today. Um, our world is a bit upside down. Um, there's lots going on everywhere and many people are suffering at this moment and it's a lot to take in, there's a lot to take in. So these practices, and in particular, the mindfulness practice can do us great good in finding comfort, finding steadiness. So put your hands on something. It can be on the ground or grab the side of your chair, the, the front of your desk, whatever it might be, but root down, really feel that energy, push down, and then start to lift yourself up and out. Trust what you experience, trust what you're feeling in this moment. So hands are down, and the heart starts to lift, and we'll come into a breath practice, the breath of joy. So as you inhale, lift your chin and your chest, your collarbones open. That inhalation is through your nose. And as you exhale, go ahead and very softly and gently drop that breath right back out and drop it out through your mouth, empty as your chin drops. Inhale, rise up, fill the body. The inhale is through the nose. Big breath, big breath, sip in all the breath, fill the whole body. And then as you exhale, do it slowly, but completely emptying, emptying, emptying the breath through the mouth as your chin drops down. And just keep moving like that, inhaling, rising up, fill up. Deep and mindful, full presence, awareness of your breath. You feel your body, you feel the stretch of the front of your throat. As you empty, as you release, soften, 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 the chin dropping down to the chest. Keep going like this, inhaling, rising up, fill up. Deep, expansive, full, full breath. Exhaling, emptying, 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 emptying completely. A few more like this, inhale, rise up, full of breath. The collarbones, the mouth and jaw are soft as the breath flows into the body. Feel it upper, underneath the arms. As you empty, as you empty, as you empty, your chin dropping to your chest. Now seal your lips and continue to breathe in and out through your nose and start to move the head and neck. Keep pressing down, keep pressing down. Feel the, the earth, feel the body supporting you the legs and the spine, your core, and roll the head and neck. Deep breath in and deep breath out. Good, go ahead and look forward now. Right hand stays on the ground. You can spread all 10 fingers, float the left arm way up and over and take a look up at that top hand, taking a nice side stretch here, leaning way over. Go ahead and send your gaze down to the ground, relaxing your jaw. Feel the right hand pressing, feel the legs supporting you. As you inhale, come back up to center. Both arms will lift, reach up, reach up, welcome. Left hand pushes down, feel the ground. You feel the support underneath the body, right? Feel the breath opening, stretching, expanding here. Full breath, good. Send your gaze back to center, reach your arms all the way to the sky, a big stretch. Pull your shoulders up to your ears, big breath here, and bring your hands together as you exhale, your hands come right through the midline, over your nose, your mouth, your hands resting here at your heart in a prayer. And just close your eyes for a moment. We do this practice for the benefit of all beings and set an intention for this day, for your practice in this moment. And with awareness, with intention, hold, hold this with great compassion, with great kindness. 
Take a deep breath in, and as you exhale, send that intention out. You can drop your hands back down to your legs and start to circle around, move around in your spine. So again, your seat can be on the ground, it can be in a chair, but move, move the body. Start to feel the hips. Again, you're moving from a very grounded place. You have a foundation to support you. The earth is beneath you. Circle around in the opposite way. Good, opening the body up. Put your hands on your thighs and let's do some flowing movements here for the spine. Inhale, go forward. Your elbows can move alongside the ribs. And as you exhale, round back and feel the spine, the opening. Front of your chest is open, the chin is lifted as you go forward and as you round your chin, dropping down towards your chest, you can shrug your shoulders on that action. Coming forward, collarbones open, exhaling, chin to chest. A few more like this, inhaling, flow forward, exhaling, round, round, round. Good, come back up to center, a little shrug of your shoulders. We're going to continue that movement and I'm going to go on my hands and knees. You can do this also standing if you wish. So we're going to continue to flow with the spine. It's moving things out of the way. I happen to have a yoga mat today that I'm working on. But again, part of what I adore about this practice is that you don't need anything, right? You just need this awareness to practice. Spread your 10 fingers, right? If you're here standing, your hands can be on your thighs. Look down, make sure that the legs are tracking right out of your hips. So you don't want to be too wide. You don't want to be too narrow. If you're standing, make sure the feet are pointed straight ahead and flow, flow, flow. Cat spine and cow spine. And that breath that we began the practice with, you inhale through your nose, look forward. As you exhale, let's exhale it through your mouth as you round into the cat pose. Inhale through the nose, empty through the mouth. And go slow, no hurry, no hurry at all. Inhaling forward, tailbone lifts, belly drops, exhaling round, tailbone softening, relaxed head and neck. Continue to move like that. The breath is through the nose in, the breath is out through your mouth. Few more like this. Inhaling, deep, clear breaths. Exhaling. And feel free now to, to move around and explore. I'm going to kind of circle into my hips and elbows can bend a bit. So move in a way that is conscious, right? You're very aware of your movements, they're intentional. You can go slow and just discover areas in the body that. Uh, are feeling really open and appreciate that. Could be maybe the shoulders for you today, or maybe your hips are feeling quite open and spacious. And at the same time, appreciate and notice areas that feel tense or sore. Again, um, the world is a bit upside down. I, I think a lot of us are taking it all in and the body knows, the body really takes it in and holds tension. So feel what you feel. Breath is flowing and full. Good, good, come to a neutral place. So if you're standing, uh, you can rest your hands maybe against the wall or the back of your chair. If you're on the ground, hands down on the ground, extend your left leg back, keep the toes down and then push and pull a bit, right? Push through the heel and pull forward, feel the stretch through the whole of the leg, finding space and breath here. Good, inhaling. Exhaling, go ahead and lift that left leg off the ground. Bend the knee and circle into the hip. So this is moving this leg bone around the leg in the hip socket. You feel the glutes working there. You feel the movement in the hip joint itself. And then go ahead and step that foot forward. So you're in a lunge position. If you're down on the ground, you might pad up. I'm gonna put a, a cushion underneath my knee, pushing forward and pulling back. If you're standing, you can stand up to do this lunge, just kind of push forward and pull back a bit. Coming up, we'll put the hands on top of one another, right on the, the front thigh. And start to open up the chest. I'm pushing forward. I'm bending a bit into that front leg. Arms come out. So you can cactus your arms here. Let the forearms drop back and open up the chest. The collarbones are nice and wide and spacious. 
interlace your hands back behind your head, support the head. And again, go ahead and look up. You can sneak your thumbs right here to the hinge of your jaw and give yourself a little massage there. Maybe a massage at the base of the neck as well. Again, the body is very capable of responding and reacting in tension and in stress. And sometimes that tension gets a bit trapped. So feel, feel wherever you feel it. I've been feeling it in the back of my head lately. Good, look forward, sweep your arms to the sky. Big breath, yeah. Deep and clear with your breath. Good, bring your hands back together. Bring your hands to a prayer in front of your chest. Long spine and turn and twist to the left. Turn and twist. You can hook your right arm to the outside of that left leg and turn and twist and elongate through the spine. So I'm not rounded here. I'm trying to lengthen the spine and open up. Good. Go ahead and come back to center. Reach your arms up. Exhale. Your hands can come to the inside. Just pause here for a moment. It's a good stretch for the hip. Float that leg back. There's that knee back underneath you. And take some flow here. Cat and cow. Spine open. Again, the mindfulness practice, we're very intentional about the movement. So you can kind of slow down a bit. Breathing in, breathing, breathing out. Breathing in, maybe the eyes are softening. You can relax in the movement itself. Good, look forward and we'll stretch that right leg. So extend the right leg back, keep the toes down, push and pull, full breath in, full breath out. Enjoying the stretch here. You get a good stretch. These long, strong muscles. Lift that right leg up. Bend the knee and circle that leg around in the hip socket. Yeah, be aware of where you are. I'm just kind of pushing my foot against the chair there. Awareness, mindfulness, right? Big breath. You might take a look at that leg back behind you. Use your breath and float that foot forward. That right foot comes forward. You can pull forward. You can push back. Push and pull. A few breaths here. Climbing up, your hands can come onto that front thigh. So you're in a lunge position here. Back leg is nice and strong. And you can feel the stretch in the quads as you push forward a bit. Belly is strong. Try not to let the torso go forward, but lean back into this energy. Cactus your arms with your shoulder blades. Nice full breaths here. You can take some circles of the arms. Go ahead and float your arms to the sky. A big stretch here, opening up. And then bend the elbows, put the hands again back behind the base of the head and neck. Every opportunity I have these last few days, I've been taking the time to massage the jaw. Right? A lot of tension here. Open up. Your thumbs can just move in a circular motion at the hinge of the jaw. The fingers at the base of the head and the neck. So the movement is mindful, right? Very mindful and present. Good, reach your arms back up. Bring your hands now in front of your heart in a prayer. Long spine, turn and twist to the right. Big breaths in and out. Elongating the spine, create space. Full breath in, full breath out. Good. Come back to center. Reach your arms up. Woo. Feel the breath. And exhale. Bring your hands to the inside of that front foot. Let your head drop. Just bow for a moment here. And then front leg, front knee goes back underneath your hips. And a few more rounds here of the cat pose and the cow pose. Breathing deep. And breathing complete. Good. And then find a resting position. You can take a stretch as you're doing that. I'm down on the ground, so I'm going to widen my knees, pull the hips back, and coming into a child's pose, supporting the head today. So stack your fingers, stack your fist one on top of the other, and let the forehead just rest here. So if you want to take this in a chair, you can just sit down and drape the body over the legs. Maybe do the same there, support the head a bit your hands in some fashion. And just notice this is a scheduled pause. Deep breathing, mindful. 
intentional, giving us the time and space to, to really move into awareness of this moment. And the tools that we use are our breath and our beautiful bodies, right? Tune into sensation, breathing in and breathing out. Maybe move the head from side to side a bit. Maybe take your fingers and just massage the front of your forehead, giving yourself a little massage over the eyebrows. I'm taking my hands and moving them out into the temples and a little massage there, just a little circular motion. And then they go ahead and come up. So we move, we breathe. You can come back into a seat. I'm actually going to sit in a chair for this because it's a nice way to stretch the hips. Again, a lot of tension. Um, you can do it on the ground if you wish. <clears throat> I'm going to sit in a chair today and hug the right knee in wherever you are. Just hug it in and move it kind of forward and back. Again, you can play with the socket of the hip by moving that leg around. You can grab hold of the shin and do the same thing, kind of bringing it across the body and then take ankle to knee. <clears throat> so you're in a cross leg position on the ground. It's, it's one ankle on top of the knee. If you're comfortable with that, and maybe that left foot can stack underneath as well on the ground, right? Fire log position, but sitting tall, this is a great way to do it as well. Grab hold, right? Feel grounded. The right foot is down on the ground, the right hip, the left hip. Grab hold of something. I'm grabbing the back of my chair and lift your chest, lift your chest. Deep breaths. You have all this connection, the support beneath you. Feel grounded in your body. A deep and clear breath. We're going to twist and let's twist to the left. I'm taking my right hand and just bringing it into the sole of the foot, turning and using my left hand as a little tool of leverage to spin my chest, to spin the spine. Opening. Deep breathing. In and out. Good. Come back to the center. Reach both arms forward. Turn your palms up. Lift your arms, keep your palms facing towards the back, your thumbs are out, and then a hinge forward. So I don't want to round in the upper chest. And a hinge, keep your front ribs lifted as you hinge forward. I'm going to hook my elbows in front of my shins, keep the palms up, and then go ahead and drop your head. Maybe the elbows didn't get there. They can be on top of that right foot, that right leg. And just breathe in, breathe out. Go ahead, feel the palm of your hands. You can feel sensation, you feel the air. Go ahead and turn your hands down and just notice, relax at your wrists, let go. Right? Every movement is intentional. You're aware of the body, aware of sensation. Good, and then take your time to lift yourself right back up. Shrug your shoulders. Good, undo that right leg. Put the right foot down onto the ground. And let's go with the left side now, hugging the knee in and exploring, moving that leg around in the hip socket. Flow of breath, being very aware of the breath. You can take that, that left leg across your body, swing it across, and then stack ankle to knee. Right again, if you're on the ground, it can be both legs stacking one on top of the other. Grab hold of something, put your hands down on the ground, grab the back of your chair, lift your chest, lift your heart. Sit well. This is already a pretty intentional, right? You can feel this stretch into the hip. We're going to turn to the right side. The twist is happening here, putting my left hand in the sole of the left foot. And then that right hand is used as leverage to really open up and spin and twist into this moment. Deep breathing in, deep, deep breathing out. Good, coming back to center, reach your arms forward, palms are up, right again, intentional. Lift your arms, your thumbs are facing out, your palms are back, bend your elbows, hinging forward. So we're coming forward, I'm trying to get my elbows in front of the shins. Keep your palms up and stretch and breathe and breathe. 
Notice the palm of your hands. Feel sensation. Go ahead and turn the palms down. Let the hands relax and drop. So every movement, intentional. You're aware of the movement of the body. Aware of sensation. Feel the breath. Unwinding, opening up. Okay, the full, full breath and then gently rise back up. Left foot drops down onto the ground. So if you're going to come back to a, a regular cross-legged position, if you're seated on the earth. And again, the head and neck, some movement here, pulling the head one direction, the opposite direction. Good. One more pose here. We're going to take a wide-legged forward bend. So if you're down on the ground, expand your legs. I'm here seated in my chair. Feet are turned out, but the knees are tracking right, right? The heels are right underneath the knees. The toes are uh, pointed out from that position. Shrug your shoulders and then hinge forward. So we've been rounding. We've been doing a lot of movement into spine. Hinge forward, let your arms drop down and reach. You might grab the outer ankles here to come into this wide-legged forward bend. This one is a good one for your sacral area for that lower back. Good inversion here too if you're, you're up. Just having the head down for a moment. Breath is flowing. The inhalation. Exhalation. So intentional, right? Intentional. Feel the hips. Feel the head and neck. You might move your jaw, kind of move it forward and back. Deep breaths in. Deep breath out. Good. And then slowly and gently and mindfully coming all the way back up. <clears throat> Bring your legs in the position that is comfortable. You're going to prepare for the seat of meditation. And this, again, is a practice that we use for mindfulness, for, to, to, to really come into this moment, into this present moment. You can stay in your chair if you're there. I'm going to come down on the ground and find my seat. The movement helps to open the body, to prepare the body to sit, to just sit in silence together, connecting to this moment, to your body, your breath, with all that is happening. I'm not sure that we are able, right, even able to or have the capacity to process this individually, but if we can be intentional, if we can just sit together, if we can be still, Right, be still. So get yourself in a position that is comfortable. I'm going to keep my hands down today. Sense of grounding, rooting myself very clearly down into the ground, into the earth, and letting the breath lift you right up and out. And come to the stillness. Right? The, the stillness, the peace begins right here and right now with each and every one of us in this moment. Just go ahead and notice. Use the tools. The body, this beautiful body, this strong, healthy body. Use your body. Use your breath to stay here, to stay right here and now. So if your beautiful mind, and it does, it wanders away. It often goes forward, goes into the future, moves back behind into the past. So invite it here. Invite it here and, and take it all in, whatever. Maybe your surroundings are perfectly peaceful. Maybe there's noise. Maybe there's a dog barking in the background, right? Just take it all in. Come here to this, to this mindful moment. And keep coming. Keep returning again and again. Mouth is relaxed, your jaw is very soft. 
Invite your eyes to, to soften. The focus gets nice, open, spacious. As if you can see the top and the bottom and what is in front of you and beside you, behind you, you take it all in. You have this strong center, this strong core holding you steady and the rest of the body can relax now. Your shoulders, your palms, the hips. The bottoms of your feet. And just sit. Keep using the tools. There might be spaces, places in your body that you can intentionally relax, the shoulders, perhaps the hips. And just sitting still, quiet. Awareness, attention, pay attention and notice the breath at the tips of your nostrils and start to deepen it now, drawing it through the whole of your body. Exhale and empty, empty, empty through the whole of your body, letting go. Take a deep breath in, fill up, and this time lift your chin all the way up to the sky. As you exhale, drop your chin to your chest, bring your hands together in front of your heart center, and return to your intention for this day's practice. We do this practice for the benefit of all beings. So hold your intention with great kindness and compassion, great love and care. Go ahead and lift your gaze. Keep holding your intention. Reach your arms all the way to the sky. Take another breath in. As you exhale, separate your hands. Send that intention out into the world. May all beings be free. May all beings be safe. May all beings be healthy. Bring your hands back together. As you exhale, hands to heart. Namaste. Thank you so much for the privilege and honor of guiding you through this mindfulness moment practice. My name is Evelina, and I look forward to practicing with you again very soon. Have a wonderful day.